what's up everybody welcome to a new video today guys i'm going to show you how you can use an auto miner this is a auto miner fully functioning you can actually get it like over here you can put hashtag mine uh let's say diamond um or now this thing can actually mine anything anything you can mine uh any kind of blocks in minecraft and i'm gonna show you how it does it so as you can see over here it will just uh find the shortest path and dig to the nearest diamond vein now you can actually leave this for 24 hours just let it run and you will get all of the diamonds this will 100 percent work there's no problems with it and yeah um so there's actually a bit of problem using it in creative i'm just using it in creative just to demonstrate how it works as you can see over here it will i'm not touching my keyboard and mouse it is just showing the way and there we go we got the diamonds I can stop it by typing slash uh, by typing hashtag stop and okay as you can see we are in the middle of mining some diamonds okay so let's get started with the tutorial so first of all you need to have minecraft forge if you have fabric it will also work but in my opinion forge is better so you can press on the first thing in the description to download forge and uh, you can go with any kind of version the good versions are for forge are 1.14 and 1.16 so i will go to the latest one and over here it says the latest and the recommended so i of course go for the recommended one press on installer and it will take you to this site over here so i'm just press on it okay there we go now you shouldn't do much over here it will just uh securing the code over here at the top right it says please wait and we can press on skip and you can save the files to download your minecraft forge now as you can see the forge is over here you can go ahead and uh, run it so for that let's let it just finish downloading real quick i don't know what's happening it has a cursed number 6.9 6 megabytes yeah just let it finish i don't know what's happening okay yeah so just double click it to open it and okay i opened two of them there we go that will click it and it will op uh, open it so it says that you can install the client or install a server so just go ahead and press on install client and press on ok now if this thing does not pop up and it has some errors it's because that you need to download java and for that it is really easy there's also another link in the description that will actually install java for you so or you can just go to java.com slash english slash downloads you can download the java for the device that you need and just and then just run it it'll download the java automatically and uh yeah that's for the forge that we have now if you open your minecraft launcher you will see that we have the forge installed over here if you don't see this you can go to installations new oh, oh yeah um turn on the modded go to new and in the version you will see the forge you need just to um you just need to go down a bit and you'll find forge oh yeah there we go here it is and um yeah so when you have the forge right now you can just go ahead and play but we don't want that okay now let's go ahead and see how you can download the mod so over here you can press on the second link in the description it will take you to the github.com uh and we have the links for the uh, bar uh baritone or the name of the bot that does the auto mines and as you can see it has for fabric and forge we're using forge right now so go ahead and download baritone api for forge so when you press on that it will actually start downloading and you can press on save and yeah just let it download okay now you need to open the download page just to um yeah just to see how where it is and after you've done that you need to go to app data now this is not 100 percent accurate maybe you change the directory of your minecraft which i'm also gonna show you how you can get to this folder so if you have the normal minecraft and you didn't change anything just need to go to percent dot app data uh, percent app data percent on the search bar and you will go to this uh folder go to dot minecraft and you go to mods you will see mods over here there we go and just drag and drop your mod over here uh the thing i should download there we go just drag and drop it to here but right now i changed the directory of my forge and i'm going to show you how you can get to that folder if you change the directory so just go ahead and play the normal forge 
the loading screen of the Minecraft will also be different. Okay, now when you're here, you can press on mods and open mods folder. Okay, it will open the mods folder for you. And yeah, this is another directory that the mods folder could be. So I right now I have another version of the Byron. I'll just go ahead and um, delete it for now. Now just open the folder that you just downloaded the Byron.api from and drag and drop it to your mods folder. Now when you get that done, just go ahead and close your Minecraft and restart it. Make sure that you, when you are restarting the Minecraft, you again restart with the forge. Okay, so when you are over here, just need to press on. This is to go to a ward. It could be a server also. Let's just go ahead and make a new ward. Now, so before you start up, uh, I recommend you to take a pickaxe and a shovel with yourself. Okay, now when uh, you have both of these ready on your ward that you just made with the mod. You can go ahead and press on hashtag mine it could be anything but if you want to be really accurate with this and sometimes it may actually give an error you shouldn't write the name of the object you just need to put minecraft and two dots before it this is really important uh, now let's say minecraft call uh or and you press on enter and it will and it's a mine call or for you as you can see over here it will just going to mine some coal for you i'm sorry i am on creative let's go to the survival mode and yeah there we go it is just mining the coal for you and yeah this can this can just go till whenever you like it will never stop it's completely free and yeah guys that's how you can do auto miner but use this at any server by your risk because like most of the servers will actually uh, ban you for this and yeah guys thank you for watching and goodbye